obviously we're disappointed with today. Um, Illinois State, I, we did not at any point underestimate these guys. We knew they were a really good team. Um, they play so hard and they're very well coached. Uh, thought we had a uh, great run. If we could, you know, we had an open, good look three with the, when we got it down to 10, we're human beings. But uh, I thought that run was really important. But to me, the biggest thing was the inside play. That was a difference maker. Um, to me, the, the uh, rebounding and their ability just to uh, kind of dominate the inside. Um, in the beginning of the fourth quarter, you had a couple of baskets that kind of kept that momentum going. What were you kind of looking for in transition? I honestly don't think there's anything different I was looking for in transition. We just started to pick up the tempo, which made those baskets easy to get. What what made the, the rebounding battle, you know, so so hard for you guys in this game? Honestly, I would just say we, we were there. We just weren't 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 grabbing it. We were underestimating what we were doing. We wouldn't push them out. So just, just that. Um, with with Magic and 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 Wallen scoring scoring so much in this game, what were they doing that that kind of led them to get open shots and 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 score, especially in transition? Uh, honestly, I they're good players. Good players score. Good players play. We just didn't execute and guard them as we should have. So that was just a personal fault that we have to take back to the drawing board and fix. Um, Petra, you were getting your shot off uh, pretty well in the in the first half. Um, what were you looking for in the first half to make sure that, that you had those open shots? I mean, like Ken said, it wasn't anything you know, specific. It was just, you know, you're trying to score. They went under a lot of ball screens, so I was trying to shoot, you know, behind that, but it wasn't anything specific. Um, they were kind of playing a physical game. Um, both of you guys were. Um, was, that, was that kind of hard to deal with? I mean... It was hard, but that's how every team's going to play, especially in the Big Ten, and we have to adjust to that. You know, I feel like we talked about that. There were times when they kind of wanted it more than us, and that shouldn't have happened. Um, looking forward, what are you guys, you know, taking from this game to, to apply um, to your future performances? Just have to learn from that, you know. I would rather lose now than in, you know, February or March. So definitely we have to learn from this. Bring it back on Monday and win on Thursday. From a from a coach's perspective, how did you, you know, view the, the differences and rebounds to this game? Um Boxing out. I mean, I think when the when the shots went up, that we weren't creating any space in front of us. Um, I also think early, we took a lot of a lot of quick shots in the first two quarters. So our offense, when you take really quick shots, your offense doesn't really know that it's time to board, you know, because it's going up. So we talked about in the second half, you know, putting more touches on the ball so we could have an opportunity to get offensive boards. But um, I just think that their drive to the basket and their, their crashing was at another level. And we know it, and we'll have to respond to that. Um, in the first half, you guys shot 7 for 25, but it looked like you guys were, you know, getting good shots. Um, what were you telling your team to make sure that they, you know, kept, kind of kept their confidence in the second half? Again, we had we 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 chart how many contested shots in the first two quarters. We shot 17 contested shots that were early. That's tough, um, you know. So what we were trying to do is get more ball movement so that we could get what you call the uncontested shot, um, and to try to pick up tempo. But to do that, a lot of times you just simply have to you have to get some stops. We got stops, got it to 10. Thought we had a shot at it with about four something to go. Uh, like I said, and and I'm not putting any, you know, uh, the, you, the kids made a great run at it, but you know, you, you make that kind of maybe tilt it, but that's not what they did. They they responded really well. All right, thanks, coach.